Hi everyone, this is Jacob from ImmersiveMath.com. This time uh, we'll talk about uh, the dot product and this uh, interactive illustration here is to get a better intuitive feeling for what the dot product is and, and, and what it produces. So uh, here we have uh, two vectors u and v and uh, as you know uh, the dot product of u and v is equal to the length of u times the length of v times the cosine for the smallest angle here between these two. Uh, so in this example here uh, we have the length is uh, 1.41, uh, the length of the other one is 1.27 and the angle uh, between these two has a cosine um, value of 0 0.55 and if you multiply all these you get 1.00. So here you can see that if we change the u here uh, we uh, we change the uh, the length of u and also the uh, the dot product uh, proportionally. If we try to keep the, the angle constant here, you will see that uh, that happens. The same goes for v here. Uh, so a few things that are interesting here. Uh, one is that something happens when this. Um, this angle here becomes greater than pi half, which is 90 degrees. So if we put this, we try to make this 90 degrees uh, around here, you see that the, the cosine for, for 90 degrees is zero. So that means that uh, the dot product becomes zero. And if you go over uh, pi half, you see that the cosine becomes negative. And these two values, of course, can never be negative. So this means that the dot product becomes negative. And you can go all the way around uh, until uh, you get 180 degrees or, or, or a pi. Then it becomes uh, another angle that is the smallest one if you go over that. So, um, so, so that's one uh, way of looking, that, looking at that. And then we have... Uh, uh, another thing, if we, if we try to make these u and v uh, uh, so that the length is 1, so first I will try to make this one 1, and then I'll try to, to make that one 1, uh, like that. Then we can see that um, the dot product is just the cosine for, uh, for the smallest angle. Um, so... Uh, a last thing that we could try is is to try to move uh, the v to to u here. Then the the angle is of course zero and cosine of zero is one, so that means uh, uh, that this is just going to be the length multiplied by each other. So if we let's say we we have this length being two uh, and this other length being uh, say one then we get uh, the resulting dot product being two. So that's basically uh, what I wanted to show here for, for this interactive illustration. And uh, I hope you got something out of this and see you next time. Bye.